Hi, I'm Grant Harper from The Streaming Guys and this week we're going to have a quick look at the three components you need to do professional quality live video streaming over the internet. The first component is the camera. You can start off with inexpensive cameras such as GoPros, but we suggest you go with something a little bit better that has a zoom lens, better audio, but as long as they've got an HDMI out port, they'll work uh, live video streaming with all the components we're about to show you. One of the more inexpensive professional quality cameras that you can pick up on eBay really cheaply is the Canon HF G10. Uh, it's a fantastic camera, 10 times zoom, awesome HD quality. Uh, you can get them for around about seven or eight hundred dollars on eBay, or you can buy them brand new for about eleven $1 hundred dollars. Uh, at the other end of the scale is a camera similar to this one, which is the XA25, and it has a 20 times zoom lens. It has Wi Fi uh, com componentry, which allows you to control the camera over a Wi Fi network, and uh, it's just a better camera and it has a more professional audio interface. Whatever you choose, you're going to get a fantastic picture quality from the cheapest camera right up to the most expensive camera. The next step is to get the video and audio signal into uh, the computer or onto the network. So there's a couple of ways of doing that. The cheapest and easiest way is to buy a Blackmagic capture card, similar to this one. This one's called a Blackmagic Mini Recorder to Thunderbolt. It takes HD, SDI and HDMI and it simply converts this signal to a signal that the computer can take over Thunderbolt and the software goes on the computer and the computer can talk to the internet and the content delivery network and stream. There's lots of different software packages that allow you to do it. Most of them are free and you simply plug your camera into the capture device. There's similar device for a Windows computer. Plug it into your laptop or a computer and then you can stream straight to your content delivery network. If you want something a little bit more sophisticated and easier to use, there's a lot of other components. Uh, this one is called the Teradek Video Mini, and this is the, one of the latest products on the market. You can see it's not much bigger than a box of matches, and it has about two hours to three hours streaming time. It's got an internal battery, and it connects to the Wi-Fi network at the venue, or your own Wi-Fi hotspot, which could be your iPhone or your Android device. device. It also connects to the Live at You uh, iPad app, which allows you to mix content such as graphics, lower thirds, scores, and pre-shot video into your production. Um, the next product that you can use is a bigger, slightly bigger product, similar to this one. This is the Livestream Broadcaster, and there's also a Teradek equivalent called the Teradek Video. There's a, a, also a, an equivalent of this device called the Livestream Broadcaster Mini, and it's red. They're made by the same people. The only difference is this can stream to any content delivery network, whereas these devices are locked to the Livestream network. A bit further up the chain are the um, enterprise class broadcast quality products, again from Teradek made of aluminium handmade in the USA to higher standards. They all give beautiful video quality. Uh, this one's several thousand dollars. This one's $750. This one's $750. And the live stream version of this one is under $500. The third component that you need to live video stream is a content delivery network. We refer to them as a CDN. Basically, it takes your single video stream, which you've sent to them by using one of these devices or your computer software, and it replicates and transmits out over the internet to as many people that want to view. So if 50 people want to view in Melbourne, it'll fire, fire up servers and deliver 50 versions or identical versions of the video to those 50 viewers in Melbourne. But if you have a million viewers worldwide, it will do the same thing. It will fire up the servers and deliver a million copies of your original video. It does it all automatically. 
and uh, with no input from you. There are a few content delivery networks you can choose from. We generally recommend three. The first one is YouTube Live, which is a free delivery network using the YouTube platform. It's a little bit clunky, but it is free. The second is uh, Decast, spelt D-A-C-A-S-T, and it's a, a live video streaming network that allows you to deliver high definition video uh, very cheaply, but there is a bit of uh, setting up, so you need to know your way around the computer. Our favorite platform, however, is the live stream platform. It has four levels of membership, from basic up to enterprise, and every level delivers pristine, high-definition video to unlimited viewers, ad-free. If you buy or if you sign up to the live stream platform, it's as simple as joining with your Facebook logins. You can use your general email address to join. And then if you buy a live stream product, it's a turnkey, one-click, and your streaming system. So for that reason, we do recommend that people uh, look at the live stream platform, all their components. These units will also deliver video to the live stream platform. So there you have it. It's really quite simple. You need a decent camera, you need a product that can put the video signal onto the internet, and then you need a content delivery network to deliver the video for you.